Uh, this is Steven from Henshaw Technology, and uh, I am technical support. And today I will show you how to troubleshoot the kick sensor problem. Uh, uh, if you received our goods and found the, the kick sensor is not working, you can find our power supply, power supply, and uh, uh, make the voltage as 12 and uh, uh, connect the kick sensor red wire to the power. Connect the black wire of uh, the kick sensor to the ground of the uh, power supply and uh, uh, use our multimeter and uh, connect the ground wire of the multimeter to the to this ground of the power supply and con connect the red wire uh, of the um, connect the red wire uh, with the green wire of kick sensor. This red wire or this green wire means the signal wire of the kick sensor. When you kick it, uh, it have the uh, zero voltage. As you can know, as you can see, uh, when you not kick it, the voltage is uh, uh, three, three voltage. Okay, and as as you can see, you can put the kick sensor like this. This side is up, and if you install in the car, uh, just like the seam, this side is up, and then you can. Uh, use your hand to simulate to hand to check as foot foot kick. Okay, let me show you. When you kick it, uh, if you can can get the zero voltage, the the voltage will become zero from three. Uh, that means the kick sensor is working. As you can see, this voltage had become zero. Let let's do it again. Let's do it again. Uh, when I kick it. This voltage had become zero. Okay, if if you do this step and uh, um, you will know that th your kick sensor and this wire is no problem. If you can can't get this result, that means uh, maybe this this kick sensor is broken. Okay. Hello, everyone. This is Steven from Hensha Technology, and uh, just now we had we had. Uh, uh, chop shot in library of the kick sensor. Now um, we want to chop shot the kick sensor problem uh, on the car. Okay, uh, if you want to chop shot the kick sensor on the car, you need to prepare our motor meter. And uh, uh, for the motor meter, uh, you need to have step two steps to kick it to trap shoot of it. The first step is to test the voltage of the kick sensor. Uh, it's normal or not. Okay. The second step is to test the green wire. The green wire is the signal wire of the kick sensor. As you know, when you kick the kick sensor, the kick sensor will send a message to the controller box. At, and ask the controller box to open or close your trunk. Okay, so the the first uh, uh, for the first step, you need to make the uh, multimeter into the wattage wattage uh, range and uh, keep it in here and uh, put the black wire connected to the ground. Connect to the ground. Uh, I just connect the the. Uh, multimeter ground to the kick sensor ground and then uh, use the red, red wire of the multimeter to connect it to the kick sensor red wire to check the kick sensor whether have a red voltage okay let it let us do it okay uh, connect the red wire right now as you can see when I connect the red wire uh, to the kick sensor red wire uh, the voltage will be uh, had become um, 13.4 that means the kick sensor had to get the right voltage okay for the six, second step you need to uh, uh, you need to you need to um, test the kick sensor whether it's not it's working or not as you can see the kick sensor is not working but you don't know what's the reason uh, just now you had tested the power is it's, it's great it's no problem but why is not working 
Okay, so this, if, if you still can't find the problem, uh, let us to, to do the second step. The second step is connect the red wire, red wire or mod meter to the uh, kick sensor signal wire. Kick sensor signal wire is the green wire. Okay, after you connect the green wire, after you connect the green wire, uh, okay, sorry. After you connect the green wire, the voltage will become 3.2, 3.2. The voltage had become 3.2. That means uh, it's normal, it's great. The kick sensor is no problem. Okay, so uh, the, second, the, uh, the second step of our second step is kick the kick sensor to check the voltage with the voltage will become zero or not. If the voltage had become zero when you kick the kick sensor that means the uh, kick sensor is working okay let, let us to check it as you can see in here the voltage as you can see the voltage okay when when we kick it uh, it had become zero that means the kick sensor is working so uh, kick sensor voltage um, the signal is working and the uh, the power of the kick sensor is working what's the problem why why we kick it uh, it, it kind of working okay that means just now we had a cat the green wire by ourselves that is the problem so sometimes uh, if, if you not connect the green wire maybe you will face this problem so we connect it by our uh, by ourselves right now okay after we connect it let us to check it again to check it again let, let me kick it yeah after you kick it the kick since the trunk had to be closed and the closed wheel okay uh, kick it again had to be open uh, that is the today today license. Okay, that's all.